you have all it takes. You followed the right curriculum, went to the right school, got the best of diplomas. You know the right people. You've been to places. But have you heard about soft skills, body language, self-motivation? This is now brought to you by Epicentec Radio France. Hello and welcome again. Today, in our series on the essentials of success, those things that will make you, that ensure that you succeed tomorrow. Today, we are speaking about the subject of speaking effectively or communicating, as they call it, effectively. In one word, what is communicating effectively? Now, let's go first. Do you know that only very minute schools in this world offer communication as a course? That is, communicating effectively because there's 1,000 ways of communicating. Or you go to school, they offer communication in general terms. But are you communicating effectively? Now, that is the main, main question. Because speaking is one thing, but speaking effectively for results, it's yet another thing. In fact, when you communicate, you are telling somebody a story of where you have been, where you are now, and where you intend to go tomorrow. That is what you are bringing out when you communicate. People believe that when they go to school, they study all the, all the rules in this world. Great, it's fantastic when you have the diploma or the degree or the certificate. Wonderful. But do you know that as soon as you are invited for an interview, the essence of your certificate or your degree or your qualification stops at the door. As soon as you open the door, the meaning of your certificate is gone. What the guy who invited you wants to hear from you is how effectively do you communicate? What would you tell him? How would you convince him? that you are good for the particular job you are asking for. Communication plays a very grandiose role in our success. But people, very, very, very few people know this. Or they know, but they don't really do anything about it. I tell you, communication is the key, is the central key to our success in life. It is because we spend our time talking, discussing with people. Now, the way you speak would certainly determine how people will take you. If you go for an interview, believe me, as soon as you are you are invited, the person who invited you wants to hear you speak. Now, before he invites you, he has certain things to hear from you. He wants to hear some stories some information from you. Now, your ability to understand exactly what he wants to hear from you and your ability to tell him exactly what what he is expecting from you will certainly give you the job. But if you can't, even even if you have the best of diploma, you went to the best university in the world and you are not able to communicate effectively, you cannot get the job. You can't because he is making his decisions immediately he saw you. Immediately he sees you, the decision making process is on. How you speak with your body, how you speak with your voice and how you use, what kind of words do you use? These are the compliments or the essential things in speaking or communication. Body language, the tone of your voice and the words you use. These are the main aspects. The way you carry yourself will tell somebody who you are exactly. Even if you are not saying anything, your body language tells a story about you. The tone of your voice, it represents about 38% of your communication. Your body language represents about 55%. 
7% only for words. So do not concentrate on words alone. They just carry a minute percentage of your overall communication. It is your body, yourself, your personality that determines a great deal of who you are and how you communicate. So this is just but the tip of the iceberg. This is just the beginning of what communication is all about, but it represents a great deal to your success. And until next time, my friends, keep listening in. The program you just listened to was brought to you by Epicentec Radio France. Thank you for listening.